Hello everyone, this is Ms. Natu, your world history teacher. I hope you are doing well, safe and sound. In this tutorial, I will discuss the material included in week number seven. Uh, now for the first day of week number seven, we are going to continue working on the A1 project, specifically step number three, which is um, applying the campaign, gathering statistics, um, gathering, um, I would say, information um, that highlight um, the essential or the key elements of your campaign. How did you stress awareness or spread awareness? Um, on the 16th, you are going to continue working on step number three um, of the A1 project. And then we are going to, on the 17th, we are going to start um, discussing or explaining a new unit, basically a new topic, topic number three, ancient Indian China. Um, on this unit page, you are going to find a teacher's tutorial that explains what material are we are going to cover in this unit. So please watch the video. So on the 17th, we are going to start with lesson with the first lesson of unit of topic number three, lesson 3.1, early civilization in South Asia, part one. We are going to discuss the geography um, of um, the Indian subcontinent. You are going to find some uh, questions that you are going to work on in groups, and then we will discuss them together. Of course, you need to write you the answers in your notebooks. And then we are going to move on to an interesting um, activity um, that highlights how the Hindu civilization vanished. For what reasons? It's a very controversial topic. Historians, till now, they do not know the reason behind um, um, the, the, this disappearance. Um, you are going to investigate um, the disappearance of the Indus uh, uh, Valley civilization according to specific methods that, uh, that the historians came up with. Each group will be given a specific theory to, uh, to Google, to research um, and gather information about and build a hypothesis about it. Um, yeah, so you are going to research, gather information and construct a PPT that provide where you provide ev pieces of, ev of evidence, um, the hypothesis itself, and the analysis. Right? I'm going to give you time to work on it. Now, on the 19th is your A1 exam. Make sure that you study there, that you go over the study guide, check the material included, check the exam's components. It's multiple choice, true or false, short responses, long responses, as the as for the material included, uh, in I included only topic uh, number number two, sorry, it's not one, it's topic number two, the ancient Middle East and Egypt. Um, lessons included civilizations emerge in Sumer, 2.2 empires in Mesopotamia, and two, um, and lesson 2.4, Egyptian civilization, okay? Make sure that you study from the physical book copies, the class notes, the BC tutorials, PPTs, and images. Um, you are going to find a PPT on lesson, lesson number uh, 2.1 and 2.2 Mesopotamia, and you also have another PPT on Egyptian civilization that will aid your understanding and specific tutorials and activities uh, from essential, I would say, pages. This is not the only page you study from. Please, it's only a guide, okay? And good luck. Now, sorry, we need to shift them. Okay, so before the exam one day, we are going to, um, you are going to uh, keep on working on the, the interactive activity that revolves around the lost Hindu civilization. You're gonna continue researching and building your PPTs. Here you have leading questions that will help you, I would say, centralize your research uh, and your application of the information that you gathered. And yeah, 
that is it. Thank you so much for listening and have a nice day.